Hello, my name is Nora Burnett Abrams. I am the Mark G. Falcone Director at the Museum of Contemporary Art Denver and the curator of the exhibition Keith Haring, Grace House Mural. This exhibition focuses on one mural that Keith Haring painted in 1983-84 that was realized in a building called Grace House. Grace House was a building owned and operated by the Ascension Church in New York City. It was given to the church by the benefactor Joseph P. Grace, whose name is honored on this plaque. Grace House operated as a youth home. Those who lived at Grace House were teens from across the city of New York, two of whom in the early 80s befriended the artist Keith Haring, whom they met at a downtown club called Paradise Garage. And they asked of him repeatedly to paint a mural in the home to inspire and bring joy to the young people who were living there. Herring, who always enjoyed working with children and young people and made it a very uh, important part of his practice that he always was involved in projects that both involved and incorporated young people in the making of a work and also created projects that would benefit young people and children by making murals and paintings and installations in children's hospitals, um, on children's playgrounds, at schools, etc. frankly, around the world. So he was certainly interested in this project. And after about six months, they were persuasive enough with the proprietor of Grace House, who eventually said, OK, fine, he can paint a mural in the stairwell here. The mural flowed from the ground floor up two stories and really plays with the idea of staircases as sites of motion and movement, of the body in action. It's not a place of stasis, it's a place of dynamic movement, of energy being expelled and expressed. One of the reasons this is such an important exhibition for MCA Denver and frankly for the residents of the state of Colorado is that this is the first time that Keith Haring is having a monographic or solo exhibition in this state ever. Thank you for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel.